What is going on guys? Welcome to another video of Clapped Out Garage. And today we're gonna be pulling the body panels off of the wide body U92. So we can go and start painting them. I will be painting them myself with some rattle cans like I did for the rear, which actually look pretty good. So we're just gonna jump right into it because I have a lot of things to get done today with this car. So I'm gonna put you guys on a time lapse of me removing the body panels and then probably get back on to once to paint them or whatnot. I'm debating on whether I should cut the bottom right there because it doesn't quite line up with the side skirts. I'm not too sure how to really, I don't wanna fill it in, but obviously it's not, you know. So I'm thinking of cutting it maybe here and then pushing it in, maybe. I'm, I'm not, I don't know. Anyways, let's just, let's get right to it. So we got the body panels pulled off, except for the side skirts. I still gotta do those, but we're gonna do one side at a time. Uh, probably gonna start off with the front. So the rear's already painted. Um, and then I gotta figure out how to do my turning signals on the kit itself. So, as you guys can obviously tell, I am no expert when it comes to this type of things. So, this should be very fun. But back to the time lapse. All right, so the side skits are off. Had a degreaser the skirts and the front of the fenders so they can, oh, now we're waiting for them to dry up and then I'll take them out to the back and paint them that I did. Probably gonna do that part off camera just because it's gonna be a long process, but I will get back to you guys once it's all done and they're ready to install. Okay, so update on the paint. Um, I got both the fender and the skirt painted, and it's actually looking pretty decent. For rattle can, <laughs> has a nice little gloss to it. I put about two or three coats on them already. I'm using a high heat engine enamel, which is this stuff right here. So, like I said though, it's not looking bad. So, should look nice once it's all said and done. I still do gotta do a um, coat or two on this one. I'm just waiting for it to dry. But other than that though, like I said, very nice. So, I will update you guys once I get further into it. Okay, so, the side skirts are dried up and so is the front but here's how they look so they're almost perfect with the color of the car itself it's not as shiny as you can tell on the door it doesn't reflect as much but it's pretty close can uh i can't really complain so now i'm doing the front bumper i'm gonna take you guys back there for that real quick little walk it's like all the way over there so now i'm doing the front bumper and your house here's how it's looking so far there's still a couple things that i still gotta paint but it's just the first coat so i don't think it's too bad um for a diy anyway so 
I'm gonna keep going and then I'll let you guys once I'm done with whatever I'm doing or once I'm done. Cause then I gotta go and wash the car, see how it all looks. But for now though, it's, it's looking pretty good. Okay, so update on the wide body paint. It looks great. A lot better than what I thought it would. I still gotta fix a little bit and repaint the one fender because I scratched it putting it on. But, oh my God, look at that. I still haven't really bolted much on. But it looks great. Obviously that right there is gonna get bolted back on. And then I gotta wash the car. But it looks, it looks great. I'm almost done putting it back together. And then I gotta go and get a new tire because I shredded the one on the other side, on the driver's side. So, we're gonna go wash the car after I'm done putting everything back on. I wash it, and then we're gonna go and get the new tire. I'm thinking about painting my wheels black. I'm just getting the car all blacked out, just all murdered out. So I might do that. But on the next time though, I do have to do downpipes. So maybe when I do my downpipes and I have it up in the air, I'll take the wheels off and I'll paint them. But it looks it looks so good. So good. Okay, so everything is finally bolted up. You can see over there. That looks so good. So I'm gonna go wash it. It's been drying for a couple of hours. It's just spray paint, I don't really think. It, it needs that much time to cure. But I'm gonna go wash it. And then probably we're gonna go get the new tire for the side that I shredded and see how that goes. I cleaned up basically almost everything. Looks really good, at least on camera. I mean, the paint's not too good. I did screw it up already. But other than that though, looks great. So we're gonna go wash it and then get a tire. So I'll see you guys when I get in the car because I gotta go get some stuff ready first okay uh, I left my door open I was in, in the house for like an hour and I just realized that I left my door open so uh, let's get this thing started I'm going to get my new tire and whoops oh, I gotta put my trim back on so let me put my trim back on I'll catch you guys in a little bit Okay, so we got the tires put on, the two front tires, actually the one front tire, I, I, the other one was good. Um, so now we're on the way back home, probably gonna wash it over it at my house, and then I'll do like a little montage so you guys can see how the wide body came out. Um, it looks good. I already cracked the front bumper though, uh, more than it already was when I was coming down my driveway. Okay, so we're back at my house. Can we just say, or can I just say, come on, how good this thing looks. It's still dirty, I haven't washed it, but it looks really good. Oh, I love it. I hope I just got that. All right, oh, we're gonna wash the car in a little bit, and then we're probably gonna start on our next project. On the next video which will be down pipes and we're back uh, it's been like three hours since i left since i i, I recorded anything um i'm going to the car wash now i'm going to clean my car which is kind of pointless to get it's gonna rain for the rest of the week but i at least want to clean it to see how close the the uh shades of black are so hopefully they're 
close and they're not super noticeable. Um, and I've said it a lot this video, but it really looks so good now that it's painted and it's not gray and black and purple and orange and yellow and you know what I'm saying. So going to the car wash by myself, I was trying to get Lindsay, but who knows where he's at. So we will see you guys when we get to the car wash. Get it all nice and clean. There's this dude next to me that has this badass uh, Camaro for the Mahoney Valley Speedway event. And this thing is so badass. He's like right there, look. I think it's fucking cool. gonna end the vlog here hope you guys enjoyed <laughs> like subscribes and like always and he's a pansy hey. <laughs> Peace.